Michael Cohen here with the latest in Jackals highlights. Jackals and the Miners on a Friday night. This Richard Stock, bottom of the first, hits this one at the deep right field with the bases loaded. It would bring in a run, the first run of the day for the Jackals as they would take a one to nothing lead. Move right along. Jackals keep pounding the offense. This time Michael O'Neill drives this run into the corner and right. It will bring in a run for the Jackals. It's an RBI double for O'Neill and it is now a 2-0 lead in favor of the Jersey team. Moving right along again, it is going to be Richard Stock going the other way. This time into left field for a base hit. It brings in a run. Jackals would have three runs in the second inning to take a 4-1 lead. Now Devontra Richardson's up. He hits this one deep into the corner in left. That's going to get over the head of the left fielder for a base hit. It will bring a run in as the Jackals would take a lead of 7-1 in this ballgame. Unfortunately, the bullpen decided to make it interesting, making it a 7-6 game. So Richardson's up again, this time in the eighth, and he goes boom. This one off the top of the wall in left center field. It's an RBI triple as Johnny Bladell comes in to score. Then the Miners throw the ball around, and that allows Richardson to come in and score. It's a two-run inning for the Jackals. It's 9-6. Now it's Jose Jose, and he gets a strikeout here, gets a couple of strikeouts in the ninth to end it, and the Jackals get off the schneid against the Miners. They win 9-6 back in first place in the Can-Am League.